New season, new boots. I'm Jonathan Buckhouse. In today's video, I'm going to teach you guys how to deal with boot pain. Try to avoid it. Make sure you're not getting boot pain when you're on the mountain because boot pain is the absolute worst when you're trying to snowboard. All right, tip number one is the most basic thing that you could possibly do. But after you get your boots, just put them on and walk around your house, do your normal activities, go cut the grass, whatever you got to do, just put on the boots. Some people actually jump into their hot tub with their boots and then they jump out, you know, then they do like the stretches, the things that kind of like loosen up the boot a bit. That way it's going to feel more loose when you're on the mountain. I don't really recommend jumping in a hot tub, but you can. But depending on where you get your boots, most ski shops actually have the ability to heat mold your boot. That's basically where they take your boot, they put it inside of a microwave, they're going to pull it out and you'll be able to put your foot in. It's going to be nice and warm in there and it should form fit to your foot, which will and can help with your boot pain that you're going to be having on the mountain. But you can still get it after that. But if you buy your boots online or something, you still can go into these shops and ask if you can get your boot heat molded. They might charge you a little bit of a fee, but getting your boots heat molded is another way to help deal with the boot pain. One of the little hacks that I like to do is when I'm driving to the mountain, I actually have boot warmers in my car and I just kind of put them in there. And when I show up, the boot is already kind of warm warmed up and so when I put my foot in once again it's going to just help warm it to my foot so when that first two three runs of the day my feet aren't hurting because like the boot was cold or, or not just warmed up you know what I'm saying so a boot warmer in the car that's not a bad move honestly I think the best tip for avoiding boot pain not having any boot pain is buying an evolution sticker there's rumors that they do help with boot pain so those are linked down in the description but that is a joke honestly though going inside for 10 minutes taking a break getting your feet out of the boots throughout the day is another great way to avoid the boot pain once your feet do start hurting it's it's mainly from like lack of blood flow blood not actually getting to your foot but also another thing you do that way you don't lose the circulation to your foot the blood is when you're getting on the chairlift just loosen your bindings just a little bit obviously we don't want to go too loose we don't want the board to fall off the chairlift but if you give yourself a little bit of a a loosen if you don't need your bindings to be extremely tight while you're going up the lift you know loosen them up a bit and kind of let that blood kind of flow back into your foot another thing you can do too is pop your boas or untie your, sh your shoestrings whatever you know loosen the boot up once again we're just trying to get that blood to flow back into those feet so they stop hurting so you know loosen your boots while you're going up the lift you do have to retighten them when you get back up to the top but that five minutes of like retightening them you know getting yourself ready again is totally worth it if you're gonna have a run with no pain and then when you're on the chairlift don't just let your foot dangle you know once again you can get that we had pressure point losing circulation to your foot make sure you're holding your foot up pulling the safety bar like with the rest foot rest or whatever do what you need to do that your foot is not dangling on the chairlift and once again just cutting off circulation to your lead foot and that was my final tip to not get boot pain on the mountain i hope that helps you guys because i know what it's like to have boot pain because i ride two sizes too small on my boots so i have a moment where it's like ah absolute worst pain in the world so one subscribe if these tips do help you and once again thank you so much for shredding with me today and as always thanks for watching keep evolving we'll see you tomorrow in another video it is daily on this snowboard channel